Hi guys and welcome back to the channel. So today's video is actually kind of like a follow on from a video that I put out in December 2020. So if you guys remember this video with Natasha at Department Studio in Manchester, later that day we actually had another shoot with um, an amazing model called Raymond and we shot, you know, a little bit of Portra 800 and some digitals. And I've been holding on to that footage because it belonged to a class that I was putting out on Skillshare. So if you guys have been following me for a while, then you probably already know that I have a new class out on Skillshare, which walks you through my portrait process, you know, from finding inspiration to directing your models to delivering the photos at the end of the shoot. But what I wanted to do was I still wanted to show you guys some of the behind the scenes from this shoot. And the behind the scenes was filmed very kindly by Naomi, who you guys might already know. She's an amazing photographer and videographer. I'm gonna link her in the description. So we do have um, quite a bit of film, quite a bit of digital. The film I will say is, you know, underexposed. It's more underexposed than I would have wanted it to be. Uh, but I still wanna share it because there are still a few photos in there that I like. But if you guys want to check out the Skillshare class, I'm going to link that in the description. If you use the link in the description, you can get a two week free trial so you can access that class and, you know, so many more classes for free. But I'm not going to talk much longer. We are going to jump into the behind the scenes. Get you to kind of like squat down. Yeah, nice. Yeah, really nice. dark already isn't it? Yeah. Crazy. Nice. Perfect, I'm gonna shoot some of this on film, so if you just stay how you are. The process is a little bit slower, but I'll I'll count you down. Yeah nice, hold that there while I fix it. But we'll go one, two, three. Get you to kind of set up a little bit more and face the window a little bit better. Perfect. Get you to look into that direction, perfect. And hold that there. Cool, go one, two, three. Cool, go one, two, three. And then I'm gonna get you to bring this hand up and kind of like lean on it, yeah, with your hand backwards, amazing. Perfect, we'll go. Cool, what we're gonna do is I'll get you to lean on the table again with your, with your arm, perfect. Cool, and we'll come back this way, I'll get you to turn around. Proper lean forward a little bit more, yeah. Nice. Yeah, that's nice. I'm gonna get you to put like your foot onto that stool, yeah, nice. Amazing. Perfect. Sit, just however feels comfortable, and we'll work it out from here. Right, I might just move this forward a tiny, tiny bit. Can you just bring this side a little bit forward? Turn. Yeah, that's perfect there. She said to press and hold, didn't she, to turn these lights off? 
Nice. Nice. Hold that there. I'm gonna get you to kind of like lie with your head. So I'll get you to turn your head a little bit towards. Yeah, amazing. Can I just ask you to move that? Like literally, like towards. The, yeah, perfect. Thanks. Nice. Love that. And then just like crunch forward a little bit, like lean forward a little bit with your. Yeah, amazing. I'm gonna put these like. If you just kind of like look as if you're like looking through them kind of thing. And just have like one of them like lay on your chest kind of thing and then like you're still looking through the other ones. I'll just get you to bring that hand like across your waist kind of thing. Yeah, perfect. Nice. I'm going to get you to sit here. I just kind of sit like cross-legged almost. Uh, face this way. Yeah, nice. I'll get you to look into that direction. Perfect. I'm going to get you to sit. Can you like cross your legs? Like... No, okay, can you bring them like up into your into your chest almost? A little bit more, yeah, cool. If you just shuffle a little way that way. Perfect, perfect, yeah, yeah. If you can't, if you want to like stretch one of them out or whatever, just move the books, like it's, <laughs> be comfortable. <laughs> and just tilt your head down a little bit for me. Yeah, nice. Actually, that's nice if you look, sorry, it's backwards in here, so I'm like confused. If you look that direction, yeah, amazing. And then I'm going to get you to, again, um, if you bring your legs up, yeah, nice. Look down at the book, but in that, with your head with, in that direction, if that makes sense. Perfect. Cool, we'll go one, two, three. Well, we're gonna go one, two, three. Okay, cool, we're gonna go one, two, three. I'm gonna get you to kind of like lean onto your knees. If that makes sense. So you're like, yeah, 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 perfect. That's nice actually, if you look at over there again, perfect. Let me just. Perfect, hold that there for me. Amazing, we'll go one, two, sorry, one, two, three. Get you over there, um, facing me this way, and I'm gonna get you to like lean back on the table. <laughs> However's com most comfortable, however you can kind of do it. Do you want a stool? Do you want to sit on? Yeah? <laughs> Let me get you this one. Nice. Just bring this hand onto the table. Perfect. Yeah, nice. And then I'm going to get you to kind of like lie your head on your on, on the table kind of thing. Okay, cool. We'll go. One, two, three. Nice, hold that there. We're gonna go one, two, three. Cool, I think that's, that's a wrap. So that's all from me today, guys. Thank you guys so much for watching. Another massive shout out to Naomi for filming this behind the scenes. Another reminder that I'm gonna be linking that Skillshare class in the description. So if you do wanna see a little bit into my process and the way that I plan these shoots, and in particular, this shoot, then head over to the link in the description. We're talking about, you know, finding inspiration, building the mood board for this shoot, um, how you find models, how you find locations, and everything kind of in between. But thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you in the next one.